F. Lee Bailey made legal history in 1966 when he successfully argued to the U.S. Supreme Court that Dr. Sam Shepard didn't get a fair trial. I don't think Mr. Corrigan is really foolish enough to try this case, but if he wants to stick his neck out, he's welcome to do so. Bailey was hired for appeal and defended him in the second trial. There was a show running rampant on TV called The Fugitive. It was obviously about Dr. Sam Shepard. And I never asked a single juror, do you watch that show? And the prosecutor, who was not on the ball, didn't ask either because everybody watched it and everybody knew the fugitive was innocent. The jury acquitted Shepard, and that was the start of Bailey's illustrious career. Before, in 1995, he was part of the Dream Team. His cross of Mark Furman is legendary. I had only one objective, to show him to be a liar about something. We all know Johnny Cochran's famous phrase, but it was Bailey who challenged Christopher Darden to let O.J. try on the glove. And I said, well, that glove won't fit O.J., and if you don't ask him to try it on, I will. Bailey says Nathan Lane, who plays him in the FX series, absolutely nails it. The, the last time he spoke to Simpson doctor. was in 2008. Because if he calls me or talks to me, he won't get paroled. He's been told that. This week, Bailey is thinking about Bill Cosby's trial. I'm glad I don't have the responsibility for it, but I will say this. Pennsylvania is a good state in which to stand trial. They generally have good jurors. In this case, there is a good defense lawyer and a good judge. So I'm hopeful the system will give him a fair trial, and that's going to be difficult. At 83, Bailey says he will never stop learning. What do you wish you would get asked in interviews that people maybe don't? What would you like to see on your gravestone? Tell me. The guy was a good swordsman, then a very nice guy. Julie Grant, KDKA TV News.